the most pike. Uh, we might know the six, 2920 feet. Trodden by multitudes of little interest. Uh, we know we're here, and the clouds in the bottom are just about clearing, so there might be a view in five minutes or so. Um, I might say the summit is of considerable extent and so remarkably flat that it's not easy to understand why it's given the name Pike. Uh, grassy field on top of a mountain with thin flakes of rock around the cairn and where we're sitting. Um, but found a nice flat rock so uh, time to have a quick break for lunch. Oh now clouds lift and you can just about see down in the bottom Grysdale Valley. We descend now from uh, near the most pike. Our first glimpse of Dolly Wagon, and as the clouds clear, that is a magnificent fell side. Certainly. Uh, shows it up to be a, a fell in its own right rather than uh, something that you just walk across to get to Hell Valley. No sooner do we leave Waymount number six than here we are on Waymount number seven. This is Dolly Wagon Pike, 2,810 feet. Uh, Waymount says the view is extensive in most directions, but restricted in the north and southeast by neighbouring fells of greater altitude. Westwards, the panorama is excellent. Well, let's uh, put that to the test. So, uh, that's the view. Down towards Ullswater, that's uh, looking northeast, so swinging round you can uh, almost see St Sunday Crag. Uh, shrouded in a mist, that's St Sunday Crag. Looking down, you can't quite see Seat Sandal. Where we're going next, that is Fairfield. And as we start to climb down Dolly Wagon, Seat Sandal does just come into view. Right in front of us, that's where we're going next. As you can see, now the view over to the west has opened up, and that is quite, quite beautiful.
And here we are on Seat Sandal, 2,415 feet. And this is Waymate number eight. It's the fifth one of today and the final one of today. Um, I'm guessing this is one of the lesser climbed fells of all the Waymates because, um, well, it's very close to some very prominent and famous neighbours. Um, we've got a swing round so we can see what we're looking at. Fairfield there and St Sunday Crag and uh, of course Dolly Wagon Pike and the Helvellyn Ridge where we've just been earlier on. Uh, but Sea Sandal's not really directly easily connected to any of them without going a long way down and a long way up again. Uh, so without making a special trip up here I'm not uh, sure you'd readily pass over it on the way to somewhere else. Um, which is a shame really, it's a, a perky little summit um, and it's not too much of a climb unless you've done four other way mites earlier in the day. Uh, it's a bit steep but short. Um, but the main thing is the views are fabulous. Um, Adventures have been a slightly lower fell, obviously it's uh, less cloud, uh, obscured in that hell fell in earlier on in the day but we've been uh, blessed later on and even vague appearance over the sun for the last couple of hours of daylight. Um, see down there towards Grasmere, looking over towards Coniston and the old man in the distance. Uh, this is the Hell Valley, uh, the uh, Fairfield Ridge, sorry. Going up over Heron Pike. Uh, Paddy Brown, there's Fairfield again, St Sunday Crag, down towards Ullswater. And down uh, Grysdale Town, uh, Grysdale Valley rather, where we'll be going when we leave here. There's Dolly Wagon Pike. Um, and that's down towards Delmian. Uh So, as you can see, well worth a trip up Sea Sandal. Oh, now we're down Sea Sandal. Uh, looking back up now towards Dolly Wagon Pike again. And we're about to walk along the shores of the beautiful Grasdale Town. As we make our way round to the Grasdale Valley, back towards Glen Ridding at the end of the day. Here is Brathwaite Hunting Lodge with Nethermost Cove and Nethermost Pike in the background behind it and look at Nethermost Cove back. A lot of rain over the last few days and it's in full space and it looks magnificent.
Oh, nice thing to stumble on. This is uh, Lanty's Tarn, I believe. Oh, well, Grysdale seems to go on for ever, really, but uh, nearly back in uh, Glenridding now. Uh, just popped up to the viewpoint of Keldas. Uh, you can see behind it. It's got absolutely spectacular views of Old Water from here. Uh, and the bells behind. Uh, seems like a, a good place as any to uh, bid farewell for this journey. Um, once again, thank you so much for joining me. Um, it's been an awesome walk, really. Um, yeah, pity. Uh, well, <coughs> Striding Edge, it was uh, great to revisit that challenge. Um, pity about the, the lack of views on Hell Valley and Nethermost Pike. Um, but, well, Dolly Wagon more than made up for it. That was. Um, yeah, that was a special summit. Uh, I think it's gone straight in at my top ten uh, top summits. Um, and Sea Sandal had its own charms as well. Um, yeah, lovely views. Uh, yeah, so Christ, that was a bit long, but uh, done it now. Um, yeah, so once again, thanks for watching. Um, see you next time.